Well, the Red Sox win it by the final of 10 to 4. Time to hear how the skippers saw this game. Let's head back to Fenway Park in Boston now and join Gary Thorne. He is with Buck Showalter. Buck, uh, continuing the starters that just can't get you very deep into a ball game. In Jake Arrieta's case, is there anything you see that he can do to work his way deeper into a game? Hey, Gary, I don't know. It looks like he's uh, just overthinking it some. You, you, you can see the uh, wheels turning to just. Uh, not trust himself. He'll go uh, three or four hitters and have pretty good command, pretty good stuff. But uh, you know he's not in a good place right now. We got to figure it out because our whole uh, pitching right now has been a. Uh, you know I'm gonna be nice and say it's been a real challenge, but it's just not good enough. I don't care who you're playing. And uh, you know there was a game there we we should have opened uh, their starter up a little bit more. And uh, there was a game there to be won. We've had leads in three of our last four games, but there's a mentality that. Starts getting there when uh, you know your your starting pitcher is constantly going out there and work, working with slow tempo and giving runs right back and uh, it's it's a tough mentality and it, it starts with the starting pitcher. How much did this does this game affect what you may have been planning to do pitching wise in the series. Well I know it may be frustrating for some of our, our media but uh, you know it's a we have to see how we get through each night before we're trying to get the all star break and regroup but uh, you know we, we have some plans there with uh, potentially Simone on Saturday and uh, Atkins on Sunday but. Uh, you know, we get an early exit again tomorrow, then uh, those plans will change, and it's it's a, uh, you know, it's a valuation in pro progress. We're trying to get to the break, and uh, you know, they're not letting us uh, keep our options open by the way we're pitching. I know you look for positives. Can you find one tonight? Sure, sure. I can always look for positives. I thought Robert played well tonight, and uh, you know, Maddie continues to do what he does. Uh, but you know, I think Nolan had some good swings tonight. Uh, made a couple of decent plays, but when you pitch like that. Uh, a lot of it gets overshadowed, and my job is to keep in mind some of the good things. But uh, there's a lot more bad things, Gary. And believe me, I'm not happy about it. And I don't think our clubhouse is either. And our pitchers are very frustrated because we've seen them better. But uh, you know, nobody's 100% this time of year, whether it's Jake Arrieta or Josh Beckett. You know, this is uh, part of the experience of playing up here. You got to work your way through it and uh, and give your team a chance to win. And we're not doing that right now. All right, Buck, thank you. Okay, Gary.